Two blocks of mass 2 kg and 6 kg are attached to the ends of a light, inextensible rope passing over a smooth pulley. Let's just explain what this means. Light means that the weight of the rope can actually be ignored. And inextensible means that the two ends of the string have the same speed and acceleration. And smooth is so that the tension will be the same throughout the rope. If the pulley is light, then no force is required to turn it. So, if the system is released from rest, find the acceleration of the system and the tension in the string. Okay, for this problem, what you do is you consider this weight to be downwards when you consider this mass, and this one to be upwards when you consider this mass. So, for the 6 kilogram mass, considering downwards as positive, like I just said, then we have 6g minus the tension is going to be equal to the mass, 6 times the acceleration. We'll call that equation 1. And then for the 2 kilogram mass, considering now upwards as positive, then we have T minus 2g minus 2g is equal to the mass 2 times the acceleration. We'll call that equation 2. Very simple simultaneous equation to solve, because all we have to do is add them. The T's will cancel out, and 6g minus 2g gives me 4g on that side, and on the other side we're going to get 6a plus 2a, which is 8a. That gives me that a is equal to a half of g, so that a half times 9.8, which is 4.9 meters per second squared. To find the tension, we just need to substitute back into one of the equations. So we'll substitute back into equation 2, it's the easiest to do. So t minus 2g is equal to 2 times 4.9, so T will be equal to 9.8, which is 2 times 4.9, plus 2G, which is 3G, which is going to be 29.4 newtons.